Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. I just got back from Home Goods and there's so many good spring and summer things there. So if you're wanting to make over your patio or your outdoor space, there's so many good things. I actually didn't even plan on filming today. I just used my phone while in store. I needed to get some footage for you guys and we'll talk about it throughout the video. If I can remember any prices, I will tell you. So let's go. So the first thing I noticed when I walked into Home Goods was the amount of outdoor furniture they had. And a lot of the furniture that I saw were definitely looks for less, but still good quality. I saw chairs similar to this on a website called Frontgate for almost $700 a chair, but in Home Goods they were only $150 a piece. So Home Goods actually had a bunch of spring and summer decor and furniture on clearance. And I think it's because they have so much stuff coming in. They have to clearance a lot of stuff out. And I love this day bed. I think it is so unique, but there are some higher end brands that make one similar to this that are way more than this. I think this is so cool if you have a pool or like a little nook in your backyard where you have like a garden or something. I just love how this looks. Moving right along to some furniture sets in Home Goods that stood out to me. I know this might not be for everybody, but I have always loved these sort of Parisian style bistro sets. You get all three pieces for $3.99, which I think is a really good price because I have seen these for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars just for one chair. So the fact that you get all three for $3.99 is great. So I noticed that Home Goods had a lot of Martha Stewart brand furniture and it stood out because it looked like it was super expensive and it was a little pricey for Home Goods at $2,000 for this set. Even though it did seem like good materials and good quality, I would definitely check Walmart first if you're more on a budget. Stay to the end of the video because I did decide to go to Walmart at the last minute to kind of compare their furniture to some of the ones I saw here in Home Goods. I did find a good amount of planters in Home Goods. They had a variety of sizes, shapes, colors, styles. Definitely go now because I think when spring is over, I don't think they carry as many as they do now. A lot of them are super lightweight. They look heavy, but they're really lightweight, which is really nice for moving around. But then they also have those really nice, heavy concrete ones as well. This was one of my favorite planters that I saw in Home Goods today. I love how rustic and worn it is. It's definitely right up my alley, and it was only $29.99. entertaining section was on point and a lot of it was actually on clearance. I saw some really good picnic baskets. I've always wanted one, just never brought myself to buy one. I'll show you guys another really good one in a second. But like I said, a lot of the entertaining things were on clearance. I just love this Tommy Bahama line that I'm holding up. As far as outdoor dishware, as far as like plates and bowls, I like using a plastic for that just because you're usually carrying things from inside to outside and you might be on like a concrete slab. Things might 
might drop. It's just easier that way and you can have a little bit more fun with outdoor dishware. They even had some really cool looking cocktail mixes that I think will be perfect for a party. My favorite things that I saw at Home Goods, this this picnic basket equipped with everything you need to go on a picnic with your family. It came with plates and silverware, salt and pepper shakers, an insulated area to keep your food so everything stays nice and cold or hot. And then it also came with a picnic blanket. I just love how everything matches. This was $70. Not sure why I didn't get it, but maybe I'll go back. I love the style of dishware and I'm still thinking about picking some up for our outdoor space or even for indoors. These are actually glass, they're not plastic, but these can get super expensive at places like Pottery Barn starting at $14 a piece. But at Home Goods, I think each glass was just a couple bucks a piece. All right, I'm just gonna call this section spring cleaning slash organization because they had some really good organization and cleaning things for spring and summer. If you're trying to organize your pantry, I would definitely check these glass jars out with the wooden tops, including these glass food storage containers for your lunch or if you're going on a picnic. And I love the ones that are decorated with the lemons. They look like they're hand painted. I just love how fun they are. Although I don't use a lot of color in my kitchen, I do like to have fun with my kitchen towels because those are just so easy to change out. And I saw a bunch of really good summery towels. Those were only $6.99 and it was like a two pack, so really good deal. If you wanna save on paper towels, definitely try out these reusable kitchen towels. I have used these before in a different brand. They last a long time, they're dishwasher safe usually. So what you do is run them under water and they get really soft and you can just use them over and over again instead of using paper towels. And I like that these come in really fun summer prints. I thought this video was gonna be just home goods, but I decided to pop over to Marshalls and Walmart at the last minute to see what spring things they had going on in there. The first thing I came upon was this really nice jute rug for my front patio. I'm actually on the hunt for something around this size that's a little bit bigger than the one I have now, but I wasn't sure if this was gonna be too big. I needed to go home and measure, so I ended up putting it back, but I did put it in my shopping cart thinking I was gonna get it. It was only $29.99, which I think is a pretty good price for a jute rug this size. I saw this cooler and I instantly thought Father's Day this is a perfect gift for any man in your life or if you're just into that retro style and you like to entertain this was 180 so I thought it was a pretty decent price for the size. All right, so these are some of the best prices on wicker chairs that I've seen in a while. These were only $49.99 a piece. They're stackable, which is good for storing away if you needed to, but I think this will be perfect for a front patio. Grab two of these, get a nice light colored rug, get some greenery and a little table to put in between, and there you have a nice front porch setup. <laughs>
to pick up disposable napkins not only for cookouts and parties or if people come over but I also like to put these in my guest bathroom or powder room for guests to use it's a little bit more sanitary that way so they don't have to really use your hand towels if they don't want to it's also another good way to add in a little bit of color during the spring and summer Moving on to Walmart, I love their entertaining section, especially this year. It seems like they kind of stepped it up a little bit. The prices are really good. I love these plastic ribbed cups. We actually have some similar to these that the kids use at home. These are definitely perfect for your everyday cups at home. I saw two different sizes. They had a short and a tall. Then right below, I noticed these bowls and plates. I love these, I love the colors. They're very lightweight, so perfect for entertaining or just your everyday dishes. The serveware was definitely on point as well. It gave me nautical vibes, Ralph Lauren vibes. Everything had this faux leather handle on it. These trays came in a couple different sizes and shapes. I just love everything in this little collection, including this little condiment tray. I like that you can take out the little containers individually if you wanted to. And this also had a little handle on it as well. My Walmart didn't have a ton of outdoor furniture out, but I still thought I would show you guys what I saw or some of the things that kind of stood out to me. This little three piece set was really, really nice. And I love the rug that it's actually sitting on. And I like that these had the little ottomans that were included that you can tuck away underneath the chair but this is something similar that I saw in home goods for two thousand dollars this is definitely not two thousand dollars it's a lot less expensive as you can see but it's really really nice but I did hear that it's better if you have a covered patio or a screened in patio these last a lot longer but I love these little swivel chairs Guys, check out your Walmart I've been seeing a lot of girlies on here get this set so grab it if you see it because it might not last long that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one.